Hello all, welcome to another quick learning. Today we're going to be continuing with our code signal uh, exercises, um, this database section of the arcade. So if we go to the arcade, we're, we're going to be working under the databases section. And so we're on the second problem set. So we did project list the first one, and now we're going to go through countries selection. So if you're not familiar with code signals, over here on the left they have uh, an introduction to the problem, and then uh, this part would be blank, and then you have to fill in the code. So the first is kind of just flavor text, and then usually I start after the first paragraph. So the assignment is, given a list of countries, your friend should identify all the countries that are in Africa. To help her, you've decided to write a function that will find all such countries from any set of countries. The countries table in which the countries are stored has the following structure. So we got the name, which is the name of the country, continent, the content, continent in which the country is situated, and population, the country's population. So your task is to return a new table that has the same columns, but that only contains the countries from Africa. The countries should be sorted alphabetically by their names, okay? So this is the, the country's table as it's given to you, and this is the output uh, that they want. So they just want the countries in Africa. So how I solve this, uh, so they create the stored procedure for you, and then I do select, we did name, continent, and population, but you could just put star because we're selecting all the columns in this table. And the table name is countries, so you do from countries, uh, the where condition, we only want uh, countries from Africa, so continent equals Africa, and they want the countries sorted alphabetically by their names. So we do order by their name and end that with a semicolon to tell uh, the database engine that that is the end of that SQL statement. So if we ran this, we will see in the test they all pass, they have a green check mark. Uh, so if you're not familiar, they give you the output. Here's the expected output, so you can see that they're the same. If you submit this, then that will be correct, because I have already submitted this. All right, so that is the solution. I hope you guys got the same result. Thank you very much.